Say good morning. I'm sure content. I'm in seventh grade, being at point to middle uh, uh, school. My weather question is: How far away from a thunderstorm can lightning strike? Sarah, sure, thank you for asking that question. It's a, it's an important question to ask because we all need to be aware of the dangers of lightning. And this is something that we need to put out there because a lot of times when we have severe thunderstorms or maybe when we don't have severe thunderstorms and just very active lightning in thunderstorms, there isn't a warning for excessive lightning. So the most important thing that you need to remember is that if you can hear the thunder, you can be struck by lightning and I'll explain why. But typically when you have a thunderstorm, you would just have the lightning right underneath that thunderstorm. So if it's raining outside and you hear the thunder, you see the lightning you're like, oh, okay, I, I need to get inside. It's getting dangerous. That's typically what happens. But in thunderstorms, you have negative charges in the bottom of the thunderstorms, and that's called a negative lightning strike. But here's the dangerous thing about lightning is lightning can actually also originate from the tops of thunderstorms where we have positive charges and that positive charge can meet up with the negative charges well away from the thunderstorm. So you can get lightnings to strike 15 miles away from a thunderstorm. In fact, that positive lightning bolt is more dangerous than the thunder or rather the lightning that comes from right underneath the thunderstorm. So anytime you can hear that thunder, know that you can probably be struck by lightning and that can be up to 15 miles away from the thunderstorm.